Um, so I was really depressed. I was all alone. Um, you know, quarantined. I wasn't going into my office anymore. I had, you know, nowhere to turn. I was so sad. And, um, you know, Andy, Andy Dick here, he came into my life at a time when I really needed him. And he actually proposed to me this morning. And that sounds like a good option for me. Right, Andy? Yes. Yeah. We're in. You're my girl. No, yeah. yeah. I'm going to give you the fattest fucking ring, bitch. Really? Yep. Wow. Okay, so that sounds great. Um, I actually had this other guy propose to me named Eric. This is Eric. This oh, is I'm going to beat the fucking shit out of that no, bitch. No, 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 you're not. No, you're not, Andy. Andy, it's fine. Eric and I are just friends right now. But that's the last guy to propose to me. His name's Eric. I'm getting a call from uh, Kermit and Friends. Hey. Yes, hello, Elisa. This is Randy. I wanted to say something to Andy before he got married to him. Oh, okay, okay. This is Randy that wants to give advice to Andy before he marries me. Yes, yes, Randy. Well, actually, I wrote a poem for Andy. I was hoping I could read it for him. Okay, perfect. Is Andy ready? Hey, he looks pretty ready. ready. Born ready. Born ready. Dear Andy, my name is Randy. I want to give you a handy. Oh, wouldn't that be dandy? We can sip on wine and brandy. I can lie you on the beach where it's sandy and eat your ass like a candy. Oh, dear Andy, our love would be so manly. But let us first start off with that handy. What do you say, dear Andy? Love, Randy. You're gay as... Wow. That You're seems... gay. You are gay FF. And I'm getting married to the hottest girl in the country right now. So tell him to go away. Let's take some questions sure. from, let's see, let's start, let's start with Andy. I wonder if Andy has a question for you. Andy Dick, uh, comedian and one of the co-hosts here. Um, What's Andy, up, Ben? Do you have a question for Dr. Rajiv Fernando? Uh, number Congratulations, one. Andy, first of all. Congratulations, you guys. For what? Thanks. On our marriage, Andy. Don't and forget. And the ring. And the ring. Hi. Okay. Yeah, thanks. Um, number two, I'm going to kick. Now, doctor, can we talk about this COVID thing? Of course. Of course. You're going to be okay with it? Bring it. Oh, I'm going to the fuck bring it. All, I, I'm happy to try to answer all your questions, sir. Go ahead, Andy. Mm, I don't have any questions. Okay. Okay. I've been in bed for two days with COVID. Oh, my God. I'm an invalid with COVID. I can't move. I have neck pain, chest pain. Oh no! Uh, when did you, when was your test uh, positive, Andy? When you took it. Okay. Um. Remember that. Because Andy is not looking good right now. Is this the usual <laughs> symptoms that you see, uh, doctor? Do you usually? Well, see I'm just. Things? I'm. I'm gonna be fine. <laughs> I'm gonna be fine now you know what it's more important that me and you are getting married hmm. yeah no I'm looking forward to it um, you know I mean I just found yeah. out today so we're gonna go to lunch after this we're gonna see how it like turns out um, and Did I we think are it's we been, back? Sorry. Yeah, we're back. I mean, it's been good so far. Um, Andy, nope. I like you. Um, I mean, should I marry somebody with coronavirus that has coronavirus right now? That's like, you know. I would get a, I would get a nasal swab to make sure that your partner doesn't have uh, coronavirus to be safer. Yeah. And then, and then I think I'd, I would get married after that. 